Hi guys, welcome back to Charlie and me, our camping vlog. This is day three of our Kerry Killarney trilogy. Uh, put it on that side. Uh, look at this guy. It's, what time is it? It's 10 o'clock in the morning. We're leaving Donahue's White Villa Farm. What a great site. You can check out the video. It was last Friday's video of the second stop of the trilogy. And the Friday before that was Beach Grove. An unusual review, the first stop of the trilogy. It has been raining since seven o'clock yesterday evening. It has not stopped raining at all since seven o'clock. And because of that, we found a little leak in the bee ball, one that has never been there before. Now I am parked on a slight slant, so the water's running that way. So I've been doing some investigating this morning and it looks like it's at the back passenger side on one of the lights but because i'm on a slant it's running down to the front of the light so when we get back to base next week sometime we're going to have to take down that light fitting and have a look and see where the possible leaks can be we're not too sure it doesn't seem to be a big one but it's annoying and the fact that it has been raining it has not stopped raining since seven o'clock yesterday evening right through the night it even woke me a few times it had a bit of thunder and lightning about 10 for about 20 minutes or so um, but right now, uh, it's, do you know, I'll tell you how bad it is, right? And I love camping in the rain, but it's that bad I'm thinking of going home. Except for we can't, because this is a trilogy. This guy doesn't want to be here, and I've got to be honest, I'd rather just drive home. Because seemingly the rain is to keep going till at least 4 o'clock, and then back again at 6. Anyway, let's make away from here. i got to go and dump my grey water, empty the toilet, and then we're going to make away very very slowly it's only 15 minutes from here but very very slowly to flesk caravan and camping park stop number three on the kerry killarney trilogy with charlie and me our camping vlog a little bit of road footage you can skip to here if you're not watching us live on the friday morning when we launch it it won't be that long um you'll see us going down through killarney again talk to you in a couple of minutes
So we've made it to uh, Killarney Flesk Caravan and Camping Park. The reason it's so noisy is I'm at the main road uh, where you make your way into reception. This camera, this is the new camera and I'm really not liking it. Anyway, um, that's the main road to the Ring of Kerry. It's going to be noisy, but thankfully the pitches aren't near it. The INEC Hotel is there. At reception, there's a Chinese restaurant, there's a spa, petrol station shop just down there. But this is where you empty your grey water. Outside at like what used to be a car wash and a hoover by the looks of things. Um, I'm not going to be able to get the drone up. It's a very, very uh, big site. So I drove around so you would have seen it on the dash cam how big this site is. But what I'll do is I'll stand over at the toilet block and I'll just kind of show you. It's a very big site. Um, they've got bike rental here outside the site as well. We're paying 26 euro for one adult, one dog. The dog is free. Electric hookup for the pitch. Um, man at reception, it's very nice. Reception area, very clean. You get a token, one euro for the showers. You get the token at reception. So uh, I'll take you over towards the shower block now. I just want to bring Charlie for a wee walk and then we'll have a chat in a couple of minutes. Okay, as you make your way in from reception, I was just in actually with reception and they were saying uh, no, no flying of the drones. There's the shower block. Camper's kitchen is on the far side. Bins are just over there where I have to go to dispose of some Charlie. Chemical toilet is just there at the end of the building. Um, I was here about 20 years ago. The place hasn't changed much. This is the same toilet block. So there's the campsite because we can't get the drone up. Again, I'll just run a bit of the road for the chip, but look, it's a big campsite. Uh, those stands are not the levelest. Is that a word, levelest? They're not very level. That area there is for if you have a car and you hire some bikes outside, that green area there is for parking uh, your bicycles or your cars while you take the hire bikes. So we'll make our way, I just need to go to the bins. Actually, we'll make our way around to the bins. Uh, showers are one euro, washing machines are 650, dryer 450. Checkout time is 12 noon. You can stay for a few hours longer, but there is a charge. They do, obviously, like everywhere, ask you to recycle. This is the bin area. Plenty of bins for everything. Not just there, but there. So let me dispose of Charlie's waste and we'll get back to you. When you make your way out of the bin area, the laundry room is there. This is the area for tents. There's a lovely seating room here with, with tables. I suppose it'd be mainly for the tenters to stay in out of the weather. Come on, Charlie. But uh, all that area there and along that wall over there is all for tents. And that's where we are there. Just behind where we are, you can see there are more grass stands here, all with electricity. There are water points dabbled around the site as well. Not a lot of water points, mind you, but water points. And then you can see, as far as the eye can see there, there are more grass pitches with electricity for motorhomes and caravans. Killarney Flesk Caravan and Camping Park. Would I come again? Yes, I would. It's not suitable, no. There's nothing here for children to do. There's no playground on site. But I mean, if you want to travel, when you go out, as I said at the intro, when you go out the gate, there's a walkway and a cycleway into Killarney, up to Muckross House. There's a petrol station just down the road with a spa. There's a Chinese restaurant right at the front gate. There's another bar restaurant on the other side of the park. It's probably a 15 minute walk or cycle into town. It's only a five minute drive, seven minute drive. There's loads to do in Killarney. Muckras is beautiful. The Ring of Kerry is beautiful. There's loads to do. But on site here, nothing for kids to do. I was looking back at campsitereview.com. You know, that's our sister website. We have a free forum there. It always will be free. And a few years ago, somebody said they were here and they didn't like the size of the pitches. Just let me show you. I think the pitches are fine. This camera drives me mad. One, two, three, and that's supposed to turn like that. There's a pitch beside us. And, you know, there's water on it. There's power on it. There's the hard stand in the center and grass on both sides of it. I think that's um, a pretty fine size pitch, to be honest. Where we are, it's fine. We've got that 
bit of grass there. It's fine. There is a segment, and you would have seen it on the drive around video, of grass in the center. There's four power points on each of those poles, two on some, four on others. That's a little bit tight. In fact, I'd nearly try and show you, but I don't think you'll see through the tinted glass on the B ball. Oh, you can. Just over there. They're a little bit packed in now for my liking, especially when you put an awning up or something like that. We're paying 26 euro for the night here with electric hookup. Our pitch is level-ish. Some of them are not level, but this one is pretty level. We've water points, we've power. That is about it. This goes, as you can hear, having a feed. Trilogy number two. This is the Kerry Trilogy. We've already done the West Cork Trilogy. We might get another trilogy in. I think we might do a winter trilogy just over the Christmas, November, December. When we're recording this in September, we are getting ready for our winter build. It's our second build project. More about that a little bit later on. It is sponsored with thanks to our friends at Gary's Glue who sponsored the van build of the Bebo, which we're in right now. I do hope to sort out that wee little leak that we have when we get back to base as well. From me, Aaron, from that kid there, Charlie, have yourself a great time. Thank you for watching. Don't forget, if you haven't subscribed already, you can do so. And if you click on the notification bell, every time we upload a video, you will get one. I have the podcast with myself and Chris every Wednesday at eight o'clock. Wherever you listen to your podcasts, just search for the camping crew. You want the end on this one? Oh, you want to do that? Okay. Just search for the camping crew wherever you listen to your podcasts. Thank you very much. We're on Instagram. We're on Twitter. Take care, guys. We'll talk to you very, very soon.